Hey guys, Gathman Fields here, and I have not filmed a collection tour in over a year. So I figured that even though my shelves are not in how I'd like them to be, they'd be a little messy. I'm still gonna film a collection tour because even if it's not perfect right now, I can still film another one later. So anyway, we're just gonna start with my classic shelf. So in the back of my classic shelf, we have those two foals. Then we have uh, my black horses, my black and white paints. We have some bays with some bay paints, and we have, we go down. And we have our chestnuts and chestnut paints. That's a red roan, but you know, ignore that. Then we have our grays. Apparently, there's another chestnut down there. Here's like kind of like duns and buckskins and palominos. There's an Appaloosa. Then we have some like a Carmelo and more palomino horses, and then this ugly chestnut. <laughs> We have my foals. Pretty cute, I think. Then down at the bottom, we have some of my shalike. These are most of my like horses. I do have a few more horses in a drawer, but those are my horses. Then I have um, a bay running, oh not bay, buckskin Appaloosa running stallion. Not buckskin, I meant blanket, sorry guys. And then we have Family Raven Stallions. This is what my mom painted. It's pretty cute, isn't he? Now I'm underneath my bed. Mm, ignore all the boxes and packing stuff. Anyway, we have my Belgians here. A few quite the amazing in the back. Some classics. And then just whatever that horse mold is in the back. I just use this space for like extra storage of horses I don't necessarily want to get rid of, but I don't really have space for on my shelves. Then we have El Pasador and a horse that I named Billionaire. In these drawers over here, I also have some bodies, so yeah. Yeah, I just now casually moving on to storing this. my bodies now in Now moving bin. over to this shelf thing. In the back, we have some of my collectibles back there, if you can kind of see them. And then over here, we have just some stuffed animals. Then up in front, we have some of my Christmas horses. So here we have Nuche Buene. This girl, who I named Royal, but is actually a boy. We have... I don't... Uh, Willem's Blender. Winter Wonderland. Don't know exactly, it might be Season's Greetings. Then we have Succession, who I named something that I don't remember. Then we have Empress, who I still don't remember what I named him. Then we have a horse I named Black Diamond. Then here we have Huckleberry Bay, who I named Finn, because Huckleberry, Finn, you know, I get it, okay. I'm hilarious. Then here we have a horse I named mm, Patriot. I really like this one. Down here we have this little shelf thing up here. We have this one that's like Leonardo da Vinci's artist resin horse thingy. Then we have in the middle a custom I did with the horse up there's blanket. And then here we have a horse name that I named Picard from Star Trek because, you know. Then we have, um, I don't you know, Elena and Elidor or something. They're still in their box. I didn't want to take them out. We have Nako or something like that. Here we have some unicorns. This is Butterfly. Then we have some paddock pals and a cute little fire engine and a rock. But moving over here, we have like kind of like my custom-y, like pretty aesthetic shelf. We have an award back there I won. Then back there I have a, like a Coca-Cola truck. It's kind of cool. It has horses in front of it. And then I have Ryder. Then this horse, Aqua Models painted me this horse. Its name is Savannah. It is a very pretty horse. Look at that. The next to Savannah, I have Sagum, who is a custom artist resin by art by Riley, and I really like that one. And here we have Shavea, who is one of my favorite horses. In back we have Silver. Then up in front we have this Schleich, and over here we just have some stuff I got. And then here I have Garnet, I think is his name. <clears throat> then we have a Yeti medallion. Who I named Everest, and then this uh, another custom that I have that I named Neelix. And then over here, we have these two artist resins by Maggie Bennett. They're little heads that you give them free. And then here's this cute little pewter Pegasus. Coming down here, I have all of my animals. So I just have a deer, a poodle, some cows, a bull, a cougar, the dogs from the protocol gift set, a calf. And then over here, I have another bull. And then just some other horses that are not like my favorite or anything, and then I just have some little decorations down there. Coming up top, we have a little French bulldog and 
artist resin. I don't even know what that thing is. And then we have some Arabians. One of them's Black Knight. One of them's Red Knight. Then we have Nazruddin, Rigel, Rigel. This is Bashir from Star Trek. Then we have Alamo, who I didn't think I'd actually like, but is actually really pretty. Here we have my American Pharaohs. And then I have Sam, Cigar, and then this horse I named Alpha. Here we have Secretariat and Wind Talker. <laughs> nice little banana award. This is Noble Jumper. This, I don't even know her name, but she, or his name. He's really pretty though. This Brunello, who I named Delta. Then here we have PBS Peace of Mind, uh, Big Ben, Gigi Valentine, who I named Storm Chaser. Then over here we just have some little ones I painted, my mom painted, they're pretty ugly. And here I just have like some flakes of gold I got from Alaska. Up top I have Bristol, who I named Blazing Honor. The next to him is Protocol. Next to him is my Copper Fox, whose name is Sovereign, but I named him Autumn Sunset or something. Then here we have Fire Magic. Imagine that. And then next to him I have a beat up Black Beauty. And then next to him I have a Mighty Buck, I believe. And here we have Tuvok, again from Star Trek. Then next to him is Big Checks Cash. I have no idea what that horse's name is. And then we have Boomerang, Espresso. I honestly forgot his name. Um, and then we have just these three horses. We have a Western horse. And then up there we have Cody. I named Dynamite. And then we have these three Shetland ponies. Coming over to the last little bit over here, we just have these two boxed models. And then up here we have Spirit, our Kleiso Stallions, Valley No Castle RM, who is called Reggie, so I decided to name him Barkley from Star Trek, because Reginald Barkley, and I thought that was pretty cute. Then here we have my Palomino Hamilton I just got. He's really pretty, isn't he? Okay, now moving on to my very last traditional shelf. I have my diorama I made for this year. Then I have my Shenandels. We have Marcus, who I named Commander. Bahana, who I don't remember for sure his show name. Then we have Benelli, the 2018 Shire, who I named Baymax. And then this Wixom, who I named Teddy Bear, although that's kind of weird because she's a mayor, but whatever. And then here we have Misty, then here we have Smith and Double Edge, then here we have Newsworthy, Baloo, who I named Scooby Doo, an Indian Pony, Simple Pine Wire. Back here we have Little Prince, uh, Emma, uh, I don't know his name, and then a grazing mare up in front here. We have a miniature horse and like the Australian set. Coming down, I have um, Baby Flu, who I named Infinity. The next to her, we have my Slante Surprise from this year. Here we have the Clydesdale mare. I have no idea what his name is. Here we have Dolly the Mule, who I named Eeyore. And then I have Jubilation and a little cute donkey down there. Here's my full shelf. In the back, I have a grazing full, family full, family reunion full, some more a Clydesdale full, full. Then there's my stock horse fulls, Leaf, Leaf Fire, Dakota, I think. We have some Appaloosas, an Appaloosa scratching full, and I don't know what that one is. We have my Stormies. Then here we have. I don't know that one's name on the end, but then we have Prism and whatever that one's name is. I don't think it has a name. Then here on the bottom, I have my beautiful Heartbreaker. Oh, I don't remember what I named it. Oh, Diamond in the Sky. And then here we have my two sing um, Bridget and Beltane. Next to him, I have a really bad broken up old timer. And then I have my two Peter Stone Western Pleasure Horses. Okay. Now on to my CMA shelves. I'm just going to be going over these really quick, guys. Up top, we just have those ones. We have my mini winnies. We have a custom I did. With some cobs. Then I have my Vallejo mold. My rearing ones. I don't know. This conga. Those ones. Up top, we have my favorite mold right there. Pretty cute. And then we have all of these guys over there. Those ones, those ones, these ones, I just got that one right there, really pretty, it's a custom by someone I just bought, 
these ones, these ones, and those ones. Anyway guys, that's the end of my collection tour. Thank you guys for watching. Hope I see you in my next video. Bye!